for number 27, we're trying to find the greatest common divisor, or it's better known as the greatest common factor. We're trying to find a number that when you divide it into 72, 24, and 60, it goes into evenly. It has to be the greatest number. So what we're going to do is we're going to do factorization for 72, 24, and 60. And we can go by 1, 2, 3, 4, and so on. So, one, so 72 divided by 1 is 72. So 1 is 72, or factors of 72. If you divide 2 into 72, you're going to get... You're going to get 36. So 2 and 36 are factors of 72. Can 3 go to 72? Yes, it can. And when you do that, you're going to get 2 and you're going to get 24. Can 4 go into 72? That's a great question. Yes, it can. So we're going to get 4 and 72 divided by 4 is going to give you, let's see, 4 goes into seven how many times? One, and then you have three. Four divided by 32 is eight. So four and 18 go into 72. Can five go into 72? No. Can six go into 72? That's a good question. The answer is yes. Six into 72 is going to be 12. So six and, tw and 12 so 6 and 12 are both factors of 72. And can 7 go into 72? The answer is no. But can 8 go into 72? Yes. 8 times 9 is 72. So these are the factors of 72. Now we're going to do the same thing when it comes to 24. 24 divided by 1 is 1 and 24. 24 divided by 2 is 12 so 2 and 12 are factors of 24 um can 24 be divided by 3 yes it can 3 and 8 are factors of 24 is 4 a factor of 24 yes 4 and 6 equal 24 can 7 go into 24 nope and 8 we already know is 3 8 and 3. So now we can move on to 60. 60 divided by 1 is 60. So 1 and 60 are factors of 60. Can 2 go into 60? Yes, it can. 2 and 30 are factors of 60. Now what else? Can, let's see, 3 go into 60? Yes. 3 and 20 are factors of 60. Can 4 be divided into 60? Yes, it can. 4 and 15 are factors of 60. Can 5 go into 60? Yes, it can. 5 and let's see. 5 and 12 are factors of 60. Can 6 go into 60? Yes, it can. 6 and 10 are factors of 60. Now, hmm, can 7 go into 60? Nope. Can 8 go into 60 evenly? The answer is no. Can 9? No. But 10 can. And we got 10 and 60. 10 and 6 are 60. So now let's look at all of our factors and see what's our greatest common factor between all of these numbers. Okay, I see 1. In 72, 24, and 60. Um, I see 2 in all of them as well. Um, I see 36. The greatest common factor with all these numbers is 12. See, 12 is here, 12 is here, and there is a 12 here. So that is the greatest common factor or greatest common divisor of both 72, 24, and 60. The answer is the GCD equals 12. The answer for number 27 is 12. That is the greatest common divisor or greatest common factor.